number five. You mastered functional programming. You can figure out how likely it is to throw three red dice, get an odd number, one of them to fall underneath the couch, and fight Agent Smith at the same time. Well then, you should join a cyber terrorist organization. You won't get to look at green code all day. Shoot guns. Lots of guns. Become Bruce Lee. I know Kung Fu. And jump off a building. Number four. Genius billionaire playboy philanthropist with a brand spanking new degree in software engineering. What do you do? Why not jack a satellite with your phone just so you can switch the channel on TV to cartoons? Play to kill and build a flashy GUI just to impress your crush. And to top it all off, build a killer AI and set him loose at your next house party. It's number three. Computer science degree. Check. Till computer graphics in fourth year. Check. Certified psychopath. Double check. Well then, friendo, it sounds like you certainly got what it takes to start a video game company and make it to the top. It's number two. I mean, let's face it. You did not buy your cell phone for any of this fancy mumbo jumbo. The only two reasons why you bought your phone are to call your grandma when you're short on cash and to make contact with interesting new objects. But now, thanks to your magical computer science superpowers, you can mix sugar, spice, and everything nice and have everybody lose their mind. Play dress up and try to kidnap Japanese Mickey Mouse over here. Pikachu? Number one. Pikachu gets on phone. Let me make this perfectly clear, Bill, so that when I'm finished, you can still see through those thick, pretentious glasses, you psychopathic, unimaginative criminal. You stole my software, and I can prove it in court. And I'm going to sue you for every cent that you have ever made. And I will make it my life's mission to see to it that you never, never, ever make another dollar that I don't first take 90 cents. 